uh -huh. and as nails fastened by the masters of, of assemblies, which are given from one shepherd. The shepherd is Jesus. You can bank on this. It's going to happen. That's what he tells you. You can bank on this. I ain't no man that I won't lie to you. If I say I'm going to put you on the fire, set you over the foundation of the world, I'm going to do so if you follow my law and accept my ways. Go ahead. Verse 12. And further, by these, my son, be admonished of making many books there is no end. And much study is a weariness, weariness of the flesh. Many, many books. You don't want to talk about, well, we got to have the apocryphal. We got to have the Septuagint. We got to have all the different types of doing books as to understand. You don't even understand the Old Testament. But you're going to tell me I got to go to the root in the apocryphal. Many books. And he tells me, he said, and further, by these my sons be the modest. To make it many books, there is no end. And much study is weariness of the flesh. You study on all this stuff, and everything is written in these books, these 66 books right here. And they're going to tell you, well, the prophet got this. What you going to tell me? That Moses ain't got this? God put everything in Moses' hand to give to us. Everything. Go ahead, brother. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Please make a note and remember this chapter. So them don't come up and tell you you ain't got to keep the commandment. You take them this. Read it again. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. So that's it. The conclusion means there ain't nothing coming after this. Go ahead. Fear God. Fear God. Keep his commandments. Keep his commandments. For this is the whole duty of man. This is your purpose right here. To fear him. And you got a lot of brothers and sisters out there saying, well, you shouldn't say fear, Jim. You know, God is all about love. God is all about love, but he killed something good morning. Mm -hmm. All the cities around, destroyed them all with a hell fire. And you tell me he, he's all about love? No, oh, he's he all about punishment too. He drowned the whole world but Noah and his family? What y'all talking about? What y'all mean? What y'all smoking? Because this God right here, it do not line up what you're telling me. Because I'm reading this. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. For God shall bring every work into judgment. Every work. Everything that you do is going to come into judgment now. Go ahead. With every secret thing. Every secret thing. You thought that? Only you seen that. <laughs> the angel sitting in that coma looking at you. I see you doing it. Okay. Write it down. Write it down. What you think? Oh, ain't nobody see me. Every secret word. You got an angel hooked to your hip. In your bedroom, in your secret place, in whatever you are, he writing it down. He there. Write it down. So don't think you get away with nothing. Don't think I'm getting away with nothing. When I do it, oh man, I messed up then. I seen it. Lord forgive me. I know the angel there. I know he write it down. But I know how to get it right. You don't even read the commandments of God to understand them. You don't know how to get it right. Most of the people in the world, they don't know how to get it right. We know how to get it right because we read the book. Verse 14 again. For God shall bring every work into judgment. Yes, sir. With every secret thing, whether it be good or whether it be evil. So I told you, everything. Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing in between good and evil, is it? It's just right or, right or wrong. Mm -hmm. That's it. But we're going to end off that. I hope y'all understand the purpose you're here for. This is your purpose you're here for, to learn about the kingdom. Learn about the kingdom. Mm -hmm. We're going to stand and face the rules again.